Hello everyone, my name is Jersian and we're almost done with the month of Jersian games. Happy Friday, everyone! Today I am playing Super Robot Wars 30. This game is in English, but it never officially came to the US. Luckily, the Switch cartridge has all the language, all the languages, because it was already localized as the so Super Robot Wars 30 is available in English, specifically on Steam, but we never got the console versions this side. But as I said, luckily the cartridge versions, the physical versions on PlayStation and Switch, I'm playing on Switch, as you saw, the physical versions include the English language pack. So let me go through the through the intro really quick and then we'll jump right into the battle. Hello See everyone, soon. Jersey and here. I have just gone through the first tutorial. This game has two campaigns, I mean two playable characters and two different places to start the campaign. I could have chosen to start on a planet or on a in-space colony. I chose the colony and I chose the male protagonist. His name is Edge and he has a mobile suit and I have two characters right now that I can use. They, they are both mobile suit operators. This is a turn-based strategy game. And aside from regular units, like mobile suit units, there are bigger vehicle units, and I have one vehicle. So the the game's pretty talky. There's a lot of there's a lot of text to read, and there is some voice acting, but it's just like exclamations when they attack. The story itself is not voice acted, which is a little bit of a bummer. But I'm having fun. Let's check out. This is the second battle. That's one of my characters. Let's put the animation on so we can see the animations. I You can turn them off in order to speed the battle. It takes a little bit of a time to load, but let's check it out. I'm going with... Uh, action counter. I want to counter that attack with my beam. Let's go. He's using the V dash Gundam. Five dash Gundam? V Gundam. I think it's just V dash Gundam. Let's check it out. Uso. Ah, and the music is excellent. And if you didn't know what R Super Robot Wars is, this is a collection slash celebration of all mecha media. There are people here from all the different mecha anime that Bandai produces. So, think from 1979 up to the year 2019 or 2020 when this came out, there's a lot of stuff like Gundam, Messenger, and a lot of different <laughs> amalgamations. So, we're going to see Mecha from all over. And, of course, my main character. Okay, they're attacking him again. Let's counter again. My main character is not this guy, it's Edge, and he has a custom mech, so his is a creative mech, specifically for the game. I don't think he has a manga or an anime. But yeah, as you can see, Uso's using the V-Dash Gundam, and it, it has a... Not a chibi look, they're not as small as chibi, but it still is not like full-scale Gundam. I still really like it. Ah, oh, that's nice. And you see the HP bars over there? That did 4,000 damage. That's great. Okay. Now it's my turn. All right. Let's go with hit with the protagonist. Is this guy. I'm going to move into position. He has a, he has a gun for ranged combat. But he's much better at close range because he uses a, a sword and the Leap Slasher. Let's use the Leap Slasher. Okay. Animation is on. So yeah, as you can see him, he is Edge and he's using the Huckbane 30. This is Super Robot Wars 30, so I guess they named his machine, which is the original one, Huckbane 30. And let's look at it. It's blue. What the heck is this thing? He looks very edgy. <laughs> he hasn't given his origin. The people in the ship think he's a civilian. Man, look at that. 
it's just X's for for the visor. Oh, almost. He has 351 HP left. Ha! Missed. All right, let's use you. And move. Do you have a sword? Let's see if he has a sword. Oh, he has a beam saber. He does. Let's get rid of this guy. He has very little HP left. Nice, the purple blade. Classic Gundam blade. Yeah, so we're just watching the animations for now. If I was trying to to grind some levels out, they both both of my characters leveled up in the initial battle, so they're both level two. If I was trying to grind, or oh, he's level three, or just do some some extra missions, side missions, or whatever, I would turn off the animations. Drey Strager is the name of my big ship. Let's see if I can attack with Drey Strager now. Oh, I can attack? You just stand by there. I thought it had more range, but it doesn't. Let's let's see. Uh, yeah. Let's see what the enemy does. And next turn, I'll attack first with my machine. Oh, there we go. We can counter attack. Okay, so when people are targeting you, you can select counter, defend, or evade. Uh, defend... I would take less damage, but like his damage, his full potential damage is 4,400. So if I would defend, there's a potential that I could re uh, subtract 1,700 from it. But I really just want to counter. He has 15,000 HP. Let's see what we can counter with. Oh, because of our distance, we can only use the particle impact cannons. You see the range 2 to 7, 1 to 6, 2 to 5, 1 to 3. I have different types of weapons. So let's go with this one. Let's see if it survives. He probably will survive. Oh yeah, and the crew of the ship, uh, they all died in battle. So the ship is now manned by cadets from the Academy 30. So they're like students. Like, okay. Kids coming to save the day. Ouch. Oh, that was not good. Let's counter. <laughs> Look at this huge ship, it looks incredible. Aiming in space. That must be difficult. <laughs> Critical hit. So that's it. Yeah. And that's victory with Dre Strager. Mitsuba, she is the captain, but she is not the the who pilots. Lane is the actual one who pilots the ship. All right. And now I'm probably going to get more story. If there is another battle, I'll start recording. So be right back. Hey, everyone. Uh, I got the choice of two different missions. I'll see... C mission and a B mission. I chose the C one. Just I'm still getting used to the the battle system, and I spent some time on the ship, like reading more story. The cool thing on the ship was that they explained the upgrade system, and basically you upgrade your units and the big ship, the 
Gracer, I don't remember the name, but you update them using currency. So I guess I, later on I'll get the choice of not doing main story missions, but also doing side missions for money, and I use that money to upgrade my weapons. The attack gets a bonus once it upgrades 10 levels, and every other stat, like HP, uh, energy, defense, mobility, and range, they get a boost after 5 levels. So, yeah, let's skip all this story. <laughs> I, I, no, I'm, no, I'm kidding, I'm reading it, but... It's pretty generic so far, and I want to meet more characters. There is a, a list, and, and it, was, it only had two characters and my ship, and all the other slots were empty. So I'm guessing that by the end of it, I'll be using 15 units per battle or something crazy like that. So let's get on with this battle. <laughs> all right. Victory conditions defeat all enemies. Defeat conditions any allied units is shot down. And they just introduced the concept of morale. Let's hope <laughs> my pilots are in a good mood so it doesn't affect their performance. Where are the enemies though? I'm covering a retreat and there are four enemies currently. But this game has a way of... Oh, look at this. It's pretty cool. Anyways, this game has a way of spawning more enemies. That's their range of attack. Let's move. Let them come to me. I have two, like, Zaku units. I just call them Zaku because I'm most familiar with Gundam. And one actual, like, Gundam type of mobile suit. V dash Gundam Hexa. Uh, oh, and I'm using other characters. These pilots apparently they know Ubo. The the other the other character that I have, not the main character, but they apparently know him. Yeah, Junko Jenko, <laughs> and Connie Francis. All right, I like the art style. Remind, it's very. 80s or early 90s anime. Anyway, that's my turn. Let's see what the enemy does. Okay. It's attacking. I have to... Action. Counter. Beam Rifle. Come on, Junko. Junko Jenko. See, this is the voice acting I was talking about. Sanscare seems to be the enemy army. <laughs> Dodged. Shoot him. Nice. Oh, that wasn't very strong at all. Okay, Junko. That was good. Oh, now they're attacking my mobile suit. Let's counter this with mobility down. Yeah. Or I can use this, which is much stronger. Let's use this. Just to see something different. Yeah, they keep mentioning guillotine. As in, using a guillotine to execute a people. But they mean it differently. Because the first time it came up, it was in like, bold and in a different color. The dodging left and right. Oh, those are the cannons. Over 3,000, over 3,000. Ah, 2,600. That's good, that's good. Uh, 
Okay, so you are going to attack using the beam rifle. Going to attack you. Yeah, let's go. Junko. I doubt I'll memorize the name of all the characters, but, I, but I'm liking the different suits that I'm watching. The enemies have the generic ones still. Did I miss? I think I missed. What was that? Oof. Okay, okay. This is great. Since the two units are next to each other, the Gundam gets to do a support attack. Is it gone? Nah. I'm gonna let them crowd me the other way. So, I, I wasn't able to beat that one. I wanted to beat it. But what I'm going to do is move over here and attack with my beam saber. Let's do it. Don't scare. Connie, let's see what you can do. Vespa? Yeah, and that was a destruction. Ugh. Must be must suck knowing that your machine's about to explode. Those last few moments must be very scary. And you move you here we're attacking um, ammo is infinite yeah let's attack this guy next turn I'll turn off the animations so you could see the little interface of sped up Thousand damage, not bad. I want to see if any of the other two units are able to do support attacks or if it's only the Gundam. You have to. In the other battle, the other enemies were hitting me only when they used the Beam Saber. I was able to dodge a lot. Alright, so that's my turn. Oh, and there is saving mid-battle. They explained that. I don't think I'm going to need it. What, are you going to attack me with a beam rifle? I'll use a beam rifle, too. Woman or not. Alright, all my pilots this time around are good. Cool. He's gone, right? Okay, okay. I thought I missed. Yeah, he's gone. Queen Maria. She must be the queen of the evil people. He's gone. Good job, Connie. Oh, from that far away? Let's defend her. Super far. Gundam imitators? Well, the green ones aren't Gundam, but I do have a Gundam. Oh boy. Five shot beam strings. Action. Let's counter that with. Let's use the Shrike Team Assault. Let's see that in action. This is still the enemy's turn. I'm just selecting how to counter. You could attack, you could defend, or you can evade. Perfect. 
Thank goodness you're such a bad shot. Oh. It's like a super. Oh, so you got kicked? Ooh, that was great. That was so great. No way. 4,000. Yeah! <laughs> Amazing job, Connie. And now it's my turn. As I said, I'm going to turn off the animations. But first, you. Let's move here. Yep. Attack with a beam saber. Attack this guy. The animations off, and check this out. Bye bye. Okay, and you, I want you move here. You're going to attack with attack him. Animation off again. All right, one thousand missed. Support attack, nine hundred. Ooh, he has 2,700 less le left. Let's see if we can end it with this guy or with this girl. Move here, attack. Wait, wait. Ah, I can't. I can't undo that. Whatever. Because I wanted to use this attack. But whatever. Whatever. Let's use the beam saver. Huh, I, I, they still haven't explained what uh, Spirit does. I just entered it for the heck of it. Let's go! He's still alive. Alright. So that's the end of my turn. Let's see if they get reinforcements or if the battle ends here. What are you doing? And that's the battle, right? Level up! Oh, another wave coming. There they go. Ooh, a boss. This is getting interesting. Stay strong, Connie. Ooh, is he coming for reinforcement? Dreistrager! There we go! <laughs> Massive battleship! Uso Iwin, there he is. This drink, okay. Please come the reinforce. Dreistrega will also help. They've got a league military unit with them. Come on. <laughs> Let's say I gotta make up for all the naps I've been taking. Okay. <laughs> Little buddy. Come on. And we're here for the second part of the battle. I think this is gonna happen quite often. You're in the middle of a battle and then 
different objectives or victory conditions are going to come up. Anyways, this game is all silent. I really like mechs. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm having a lot of fun playing this. Um, counter that. Ooh, let's check that out. Ah, I missed two. It's fine. I want to start with these guys. Ah, this is so slow. Move. Stand by. Stand by. And... There's four enemies, but this one is the dangerous one. Let's see... You know what? It's okay to break off. It's okay to break off. Attack it head on. Let's turn the animation off. Let's see that beam saber one more time. Junko! Uh, that has really bad accuracy. Your other lasers have hurt me more. <laughs> oh, I can go directly. Yes. Oh, I forgot to turn off the animation. It's fine. Connie, let's go! Yes! No. Damn, you suck. Um, I didn't want to do this, but whatever. I didn't want to use the three units to just attack one. I wish I was a little bit stronger, but that's coming. Bye bye. Bye bye. Enemy turn. So that gave me with five shot finger beams. Uh, action counter. Sure. And let's turn off the animation. Rex and relaxation. Miss. Oof. Nice. And now the support attack? Ah, no, no support attack. Okay. Ooh, this is like the boss. Let's actually defend. Because the victory condition says if you lose Connie, you lose the battle. I mean, if you lose Uso. Can't lose him. Ah. 
you. You, you. Attack. It's yours. All right. Oh, he has a shield or something? Yeah, now I get the support attack. Ah. There we go. Yes! He's gone. Yeah, that's what I wanted. And now the Gundam is free to move. Bye-bye. Go. I wanted to do that. It says that Gundam does support. I want to move here to get that support. And let's attack this guy. Bye. Can the ship attack yet? Attack. I want to do a different attack. So now nah, let's move the ship here. And have it stand by. That's fine. And you. Let's move you here. Can you attack from here? Yeah, you can. Shakti somewhere nearby. Ooh, 26, no bad. V dash Gundam. It's that's the end of my turn. Yeah. Um 35 man. Defend. Okay. My faith. Okay. Can you attack? Please. Yes, I have different attacks. I want to see a different one. And let's turn the animation on because it's the first time that I'm going to see this too. I've only seen the big overhead cannons. Inspiring speech before destroying this guy. Show me. Oh! A canister full of missiles. Oh, that's a, that's a cool machine. He dodged everything. He dodged everything. No! Damn, this sucks. That really sucks. So... You... If you attack from here, yeah, you can. Overhead cannon to this guy. I'm turning off animations. It's fine. Mass producing fake Gundams. They're not fake Gundams. Leave me alone. Yeah, I hit him. Miss. Nice. Now, it's your turn. No, 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 I have to move 
from ah uh, from here no how far do I have to be for leaf slasher can I do it oh the morale is not high enough all right to stand here first time morale comes into play Shit! That did a lot of damage. Let's use the beam saber on this guy. And if this is the final battle, let's put animations on. Well, what I'll generally do play without animations, except when there's a new machine, a, a new mobile suit. And whenever there's a boss, I guess. What? Am I supposed to lose this battle? Chronicle. Ah, why is he so strong? Oh, am I gonna beat him with the ultimate special? <laughs> Let's see if it hits. Pinky. Oh, that was cool. Yeah, direct hit. Kick. And the slash from behind. Unfortunately for you, that is how it ends. <laughs> Alright, another level up for Junko. She's becoming the MVP of my team. Oh, and there it goes. That's the ship. Ooh, it's from. Captain Gomez. <laughs> Anyways, my name is Jersey, and that was Super Robot Wars 30. I will see you on Monday. Have a great weekend. Bye.